Well, good afternoon, everybody. Mark O'Connor is my name. I'm the CEO for Steinway Galleries Australia and the exclusive Piano Group. And we'd like to welcome you here today to our live stream event, where it gives us the opportunity to speak to you and involve you a little bit differently than we've ever been able to do before to talk about Steinway and Sons. And uh, more importantly, a little bit about the Steinway and Sons Spirio Piano Range. Uh, we're out here at our Essendon showroom. It's our 12th year of business here in Essendon. And uh, I've got a team here helping us today. And you might see them, uh, well, you won't see them, but I can see them uh, pulling some faces because out here in our Essendon showroom, uh, a lot of people will know, and a lot of people may have been out here, uh, will know that we're right next to the airport. So every now and then, you may hear a sound like that, which is actually an aeroplane flying over the top of us. And uh, that's something that we do deal with. But of course, it's our 12th year here. Hasn't affected the business because uh, Steinway and Sons have done very well in this location. Uh, we've got the biggest range of Steinway and Sons pianos that's ever been on display throughout Australia here in Essendon. Uh, we also have our other galleries around the country. We have a Melbourne gallery in Armadale, and we have our gallery in Sydney, our showrooms in Perth, uh, and we've got other representatives around the country that work with us. So we're very happy uh, to be able to say that, uh, as I said, the 12th year here in Essendon, uh, but our fifth year as the national distributor Australia-wide. And we're very proud of that. Uh, we're very privileged to have that, uh, that honour, um, to represent what we believe is the world's best piano brand uh, throughout Australia. And uh, a point of interest, I guess, is the fact that since 2015, taking over the business Australia-wide, uh, we've seen record sales of Steinway & Sons pianos throughout Australia, uh, especially over the last few years. And uh, surprisingly enough, over the last six months, it's been extremely busy for us. Now, a lot of you will know that we're here in Victoria in a lockdown situation at the moment due to the coronavirus or COVID-19, um, and uh, that's being monitored every day. So this really gives us the opportunity to come out and, and talk with you direct, and we're very happy to be able to do that. And again, I really welcome you uh, to coming and being on board and being a part of this uh, with us. We've got a big team here today helping us, so I'm hoping it all goes according to plan. Uh, I did plan on being here a little bit earlier, but of course, being in this business, things uh, change, and we had some customers wanting a piano delivered very early this morning, and our team went out there and we made sure that that went according to plan. So I wanna thank our team for setting this up and allowing us to, uh, to do this today. So uh, one thing to point out is that during this presentation, you will also be able to ask us questions. Um, and we've got an iPad here today that will uh, come up with those questions put a, a hashtag before your question and uh, we'll be able to answer those as they come through. Uh, we're going to demonstrate a few things about a Steinway piano and what makes it different to other piano brands. And also the Spirio system, which has been just a, a, an amazing thing for us over the last few years. And as I said before, we've experienced record sales throughout Australia over the last few years. And certainly Spirio has been the most important aspect of that. Um, those of you that have uh, watched our business or, or been on our social media, a lot of you are on our social media, which is why you've become aware of today's event. Um, but you may have already seen some of the things this year that we've been a part of uh, and very proud to be a part of. One of those being the sale of a $1 million uh, Steinway & Sons Black Diamond Model D274 Concert Grand Spirio R piano. Spirio R, R, of course, is for record. Spirio is the playback system. So uh, that particular piano was one of eight made worldwide. And we were very lucky to, to be able to get one here in Australia and was purchased by a, a family in Melbourne. Uh, we had the Herald Sun out here. Uh, for those of you that don't know the Herald Sun, of course, it's a, a very famous uh, newspaper here in, in Victoria and uh, came and did a story on that particular piano. That's been delivered. And uh, again, part of the Spirio range. So what we're showing you today, um, the Model D Spirio uh, Black Diamond was one of eight worldwide, but there's also a Model B that was made. Uh, Model B is a 211 centimetre grand piano, and that's what we're going to show you today. Uh, 88 of the Black Diamond Model Bs were made worldwide, and we're lucky uh, as well to have a Model B here today. The only one in Australia, we'll be showing you that piano, and it's also a Spirio R. The Spirio, for those of you that are unfamiliar with that, is a playback system. And it's the most advanced playback system that I've ever seen 
from being in the business. And I've been in the business over 30 years. And uh, having been in the business that a length of time, uh, it, it takes a certain uh, exciting product to really stimulate your interest and to give you that excitement after that amount of time. And this does it, and not only did it do it when it was released, but it does it every time I see it play. Because we've had playback systems, we've had American systems, we've had others that come out of Japan, but never have we seen something that plays back as accurately as this Steinway & Sons Spirio system. Uh, I've had, we've had customers in, in the past that have had playback systems and their comment is quite often that the system can be a little bit robotic, it doesn't sound like a real person playing it, one song is loud, the next song is soft, all these things that happen with a playback system doesn't happen with the Steinway & Sons Spirio system. So what you hear is someone that's played the piano and it plays back exactly what they did. So you've got the best artist in the world playing the piano, recording the piano, and once that's recorded and put onto the app that you get with the Steinway & Sons Spirio piano, you can play that, that person in your home. You press the, the play button on the app, the song that you want, and it's them playing it, being reproduced in your home. Unbelievable. It's been amazing for us and uh, amazing. And, and I've got to say uh, that every customer that's purchased a Spirio piano has made the effort to call us back and say how delighted they, they have been with that decision. And I've never seen anything like it in the sense of that when people buy a Spirio, uh, the percentage of, of friends or others that have seen it in their home that have called us and ordered one has been uh, phenomenal. So uh, to the point that the Model B that we're showing you here today, um, also this is the Black Diamond, but of course you can purchase a, uh, a Model B that's a standard black ebony polished piano. We're sold out Australia-wide and we have some on order. So uh, without further ado, what I'd like to do is in the first instance, Let's have a look at it and let's get the Spirio system to play a song for you. Now, uh, one of the popular songs that I have requests for and that I've shown people that blows them away is a favourite of mine uh, that is, in fact, called Hotel California. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to load that song up and let you hear the piano playing it for you. Over to... The Spirio. Okay, we're back. So that gives you an indication of how the piano sounds and what it looks like when the piano is playing on its own. Uh, obviously, there's a, a lot of technology that goes into making this work. And again, as we go a little bit further into our demonstration today, I'm also going to show you how you can record on this piano. So this piano, being a Spirio R, has the R function, which allows you to record what you've played and play back. And that's extremely useful on a number of uh, occasions and for a number of reasons. 
If you have a teacher that comes to your home to teach your, your children or yourselves or whoever it may be in the family, uh, you can record the lesson. You can record what the teacher has played and then have uh, access to that whenever you want it. So if there's a particular piece that you want to see how it's played correctly and the student is learning, they can refer to that at any point and, and see how uh, the piece is played back and see what they may need to change or, or, or what they need to do. So it's extremely valuable for that. And also, you can record something that you're learning and you can refer back to that in six months' time or 12 months' time to see how you've advanced. And uh, it's just a fantastic tool to use and um, has been, again, something that's uh, extremely popular. We know that business has changed over the last, well, it's changing regularly, but certainly over the last 12 months. And uh, again, while we're in a situation we, that we're currently in, um, it's interesting to note that uh, a lot of people are getting access to information via the internet, via YouTube clips. And um, uh, last week, uh, for instance, we had an inquiry for a Model D Spirio R, which is the big brother of the Model B, obviously, D274. And we've had a family ring us up and order that piano over the phone without going to a store, without seeing it in person, but just on information from the video clips, website, and all those sorts of things. So please use those, uh, you, or take, take um, you, you utilize those things that are there available for you to get information. Steinway.com.au is our site. All the pianos are on there. Uh, everything is available. Uh, also, you've got our Facebook pages through Steinway Galleries Melbourne, Steinway Gallery Sydney, where you can access information and see our video clips. Uh, one of the most popular video, cl video clips that we've had is the release or the launch of the Spirio uh, in Melbourne. So Spirio Piano Launch Melbourne on YouTube is a fantastic clip. We were lucky enough to have good friends of myself and the business, James Morrison, a fantastic uh, trumpet player, John Foreman, Harrison Craig, Australian singer that people know, all came to that event to help us um, celebrate and, and show what the Spirio can do. And that's on YouTube. So please have a look at that and see uh, what you think and, and get in some information uh, or further information than what we're discussing today. Our national information line, 1300 199 589 is available for everybody to uh, call our staff and they can help at any time uh, to answer any questions you may have. So let's have a look at the Steinway & Sons Black Diamond Spirio R that we have here today. And of course, I'm going to quickly play something on the piano to let you know that when you're not using it as a Spirio and you're just using it as a piano, the Spirio components that, uh, um, that are on the piano have, are not working. They have nothing to do with it. So it's just being played like any other Model B Steinway piano. There's no interference from anything to do with the Spirio playback system. That's very important because the action doesn't change and you're playing it just as you would any other Steinway piano. we might do is, we've talked about the Spirio and how the playback system works, but I'm going to get one of our colleagues here, uh, Chris, I'll give him the, the iPad so that I can do this while uh, I'm still on the camera and, um, and running through this with you and show you how we record. So all we have to do is press a simple button, a record button, and Chris let me know when I'm ready and I'll just make something up. Give it a second for Chris to load it up and play back exactly what I just played. Thank you. Thanks, Chris. So uh, another aspect of what you can do here is 
If you make a mistake, you can actually go in and edit with the iPad and take that mistake out. So there are things that you can do um, that allow you to uh, adapt or to correct anything that you want once you've done your own recording. So I think that's very valuable as well. One of the other aspects that we have is the ability to um, not only have it play back, but some of the, the songs have been recorded with video. So what I'm going to do now is show you a playback of a particular song with a very famous pianist, Yu Ya Wang, and uh, she's recorded something that um, I'm going to show you with the video. So let's get that up and running, and away we go. There you go. I hope you enjoyed that because uh, that's the situation of, of having a video on your iPad and having Yu Ya Wang playing in your uh, home. It's as simple as that and that's what the system does. So if you've got any questions, remember the hashtag and you can send through some questions and uh, we'll see if we can answer them for you. Uh, one other thing that we're going to talk about is uh, what makes a Steinway & Sons piano different to other pianos? Apart from the fact that obviously you've got over 165 years of history into making the piano, all of the pianos that we uh, represent here in Australia come from the Hamburg factory in Hamburg, Germany. And that's been the case for many, many years here in Australia. And uh, uh, they're the preferred pianos that we have um, uh, sent into a lot of the businesses and institutions around Australia. We've been very lucky to, um, again, be involved with Steinway & Sons, which has allowed us to uh, build close relationships with some of the major institutions around Australia. Some of you will know the new Melbourne University building, or University of Melbourne is the correct terminology. Um, they have a new building in South Bank that's just been opened fairly recently. Um, and they, uh, for that new facility, uh, purchased 13 brand new Steinway pianos and a number of Boston pianos as well. So Boston being from the family of Steinway design pianos, designed by Steinway & Sons, uh, released in the early 90s, uh, as continued to be a developing and a growing brand of piano. And in their price range, <coughs> extremely popular. Um, the action and the responsiveness of a Boston piano, I think, is unlike anything else in that price range. And again, some of the clips on YouTube have other people stating those facts. People that are well known, like um, Dr. Ian Holtham, the director and uh, head of keyboard for the University of Melbourne, talking about how the Boston pianos have been there now 20 years and, and uh, for the new building earlier this year we re, um, delivered another 20 plus Boston pianos into that 
facility. So that's a, a tried and tested situation of people using a Boston piano in an environment that uh, the students use the pianos for hours and hours of practice every day. And they've stood up to the test of time. The maintenance of these pianos has proven to be less than other pianos available in that price range and huge success stories with Boston pianos. So again, any questions with anything like that, part of the Steinway family is a Boston and my staff or our staff here at the building, um, Essendon, uh, are more than happy to answer any questions and assist with any inquiries you have. Again, I'll give you that number, it's 1300 199 589. So we'll go back to the Steinway and talk a little bit about what makes a Steinway piano different? What makes it so popular? What makes it popular with the major concert artists around the world? When they go to the concert stage, what do they want to see? They want to see a Steinway. And why? Because they know what they're going to get. They know that the action and the performance of the piano is going to be responsive and uh, feel better and uh, be able to be played to their standard better than any other piano brand in the world, without question. Um, the, you're looking at um, the design features in a Steinway that makes it different. And you can have a look at those online on our website as well. Many, many patents over many years in designing the piano, over 165 years of history. Uh, but some of those things that we talk about, the continuous bent rim of a piano. Steinway have continuous bent rim, meaning there's no joins in the rim of a piano. That, uh, that design contributes to the sound of the piano and why it has such a dynamic range. Um, and it's, it's combined with things like the diaphragmatic soundboard. The soundboard of the piano is inserted under pressure into the rim. And not only that, the soundboard is tapered. So it's thicker in the middle and it trims towards the edges of the soundboard so that you uh, minimise the lack of, sorry, minimise the loss of vibration because sound is vibration, obviously. You hit the, 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 the piano key, the hammer hits the string. What is sound? It's the vibration of that happening. So in the Steinway, you have the diaphragmatic soundboard. So it, it moves inside the piano. It's tapered so that you minimise the loss of vibration. And then the, the continuous bent rim, where all the grain in the rim runs the same way, all contributes to the sound of a Steinway piano. Of course, being handmade takes approximately two years to build a Steinway, not, in, not including the drying time of the timber. But uh, what does that mean? It means that there's a, a huge amount of detail that goes into the making of the piano, to the point that the grain in the, in the soundboard is different in the bass section to the treble section, because that all gets taken into account when you're um, considering the sound and the reproduction of the sound of a piano. Some of the other things that are really important that I find one of the things uh, that people are interested in with the Steinway piano is the duplex scaling system. It's a very important thing that you get used to hearing and you wonder why does that Steinway sound different to other pianos? The duplex is a huge part of that. Uh, in the old times and on older pianos, uh, the manufacturers would put felt between uh, the top section, the bridge, the, the bridge section and the top pin, they would put felt to deaden the sound because they didn't want overtones and, and you still have that today. In the bass section, you don't want those strings making a sound so they're deadened. But in the treble section, Steinway decided to open it up and use a system called the duplex scaling, which is a strip, metallic strip, and all of those components of that strip are placed in exactly the right section or, or, or position to reproduce the sound that you want. So the best way to see that is to come into our shop or our stores, the galleries, wherever you, you um, is convenient, and let someone explain it to you. But I'm going to show you now exactly what I'm talking about, and I've got, uh, one of our helpers here, Chris, that's going to show you inside the piano. So let's have a look at the duplex section of the piano. This metallic strip in here is your duplex scaling system. So you'll see that there's, in the bass section, you've got felt here, between the bridge and the top pin, you've got felt to deaden those strings so that you don't get any sound or overtones when you're playing the piano. But if you come to this section here, I'm not gonna to touch it because, of course, you don't want moisture on those strings, but if I use my glasses, and use the top of it, you'll see these strings are open, so they resonate. So when you're playing notes, now I'm playing one note, 
C. But listen to the sound coming from the piano, and hopefully you can hear that via our live stream. But there's a lot of sound coming from one note. Now, when you get used to that sound of a Steinway, and of course, when you're playing more notes, the sound is more prominent. Now, once you get used to that, if you go and play another piano that doesn't have the duplex scaling system, uh, has um, limited sound in that upper section, you notice a difference and you wonder why. What is the difference? Well, that gives you a little bit of an insight into why there's a difference because it's designed by Steinway. It's a Steinway patent many years ago, obviously out of patent now, and you see a lot of other manufacturers copying uh, the duplex scaling. It's in many, many piano brands today but was a Steinway design. However, even though it's in other piano brands, there's a lot of differences, still a lot of differences in how that duplex system works. Of course, everything contributes to it because it's a Steinway. Continuous bent rim, diaphragmatic soundboard, the quality of the timber that's selected, and not, um, not least out of that is the way that the piano feels. It's the action, it's the responsiveness. It's how fast you want to play, the piano will respond. If you want to play softly and lightly, you can. The piano will respond. You want to play jazz, the piano will, will play jazz. You want to play classical music, the piano will play classical music. And that's why people want to play Steinway pianos. A lot of other piano brands out there that are specific to a certain uh, range of music or a certain genre, um, jazz for instance, or something like that. But Steinway uh, is quite different. So let's go back to the Spirio system. I don't know if we've got any, we've got some questions here. Um, do we think uh, it would help in learning to play? Well, that's a good question. Um, thank you for that. Uh, it helps to play or helps to learn because if you're learning a particular piece and you're not sure how it goes or how it should be played, well, you dial it up on the iPad and you can see one of the best artists in the world play that song. So let's go and have a look here. Need the glasses these days. Uh, we go into music and uh, Let's just have a look here at uh, something a little bit different. And we'll let the Spirio play a song. Hope you enjoyed another song from the Steinway & Sons Spirio Black Diamond Piano. Uh, this piano is actually available. As I said, it's the only one in Australia and it is available. There is some interest in it at the moment, but it's here in our Essendon showroom in Melbourne. And uh, obviously it's um, something that's extremely special and uh, I believe will probably be the only one in Australia. Apart from the fact that we've got the nine foot Consagran that's already been sold, but this will be a little bit different. It's a Model B. And I'm confident it'll be the only one available because uh, not too many of them left worldwide. And uh, only 88 were made and they're all numbered, specifically numbered. So uh, this is the one we have here in Melbourne.
Uh, so I'd like to thank everyone for joining us today. I think uh, we've covered most of the things we'd like to cover. I'm just going to have a look at any, any uh, further questions. Um, we've had a lot of comments, a lot of comments on Facebook, so thank you for that. Uh, we re really appreciate your support, uh, getting on, on board and, and having a look at what we've got to talk about. Uh, hopefully, uh, it's given you some information and uh, we'd like to do a little bit more of this. Obviously, we're in a, a strange situation um, given that what we're enduring here in Melbourne and, and not only around Australia, but around the world. So I hope everybody stays well. Take care of yourself. Um, you know, be careful when you're out there. Obviously, I'm not going to go on about the hygiene practices and things like that. Everyone's aware of those, and we're doing those in our stores. Uh, when you come into our store, if you want to play the piano, you uh, do need to um, make sure that you're taking precautions, and our staff will, will work through that with you. Uh, we, our stores are currently open, but some of them, like our Armadale store in Melbourne, is open by appointment, which has been very successful. We had a number of appointments last week, and I think uh, the majority of those appointments amounted in sales. So last week we had another order from Model B Spirio. Uh, we, we sold our uh, Crown Jewels, Model A Grand, uh, grand Piano, uh, brand new Steinway last week uh, from Armadale store, and uh, people are still ordering pianos. They're ordering pianos, some of them are locked uh, in, in lockdown. So what better way to spend your lockdown period than, than playing on a Steinway & Sons piano? So we'll help you with that. Of course we will. And uh, we can deliver them to you. Um, we've got uh, some more stock arriving. But um, the thing is that at the moment, it's always a good time. And uh, especially at the moment with stock shortages on some models, if you get in now and you get it this year, you will avoid the price rise of uh, next year. So from January 1st, of course, we've got a price increase. But um, we're always here to help. We're always going to do whatever we can to help you become a part of the Steinway family. And one thing I'm confident of is that um, people do look, obviously, at certain price points and, and look at other options and pianos from different companies that you can look at and consider. But uh, every person that decides to be part of the Steinway family, and that's why I'm in this business, and that's why I'm working with Steinway & Sons, because every person that makes the decision uh, is someone that ends up happy. I've never seen anyone become part of the Steinway family and not be completely happy and delighted. And uh, I was saying the other day about um, someone ringing us about uh, the Steinway & Sons Spirio that they purchased, and this gentleman rang me up got to know him fairly well over the years because he's a Spirio customer and he rang me up to say that his piano runs six hours a day every day and they love it and that's the sort of thing that happens. However, some people do make another decision for whatever reason, it might be uh, on price or something like that and a lot of those cases end up with disappointment. So we're here to help you not become disappointed, we're here to help you become part of the Steinway & Sons family and uh, we've got a team all around Australia that will help you do that. So please get onto our website steinway.com.au please call our staff on our national information line all around Australia you can call 1300 199 589 and our staff will help you try not to call at uh, 1 o'clock in the morning it does happen and uh, we have the phones diverted so if you want to wake me up or someone up uh, you can do that but uh, preferably not so please call uh, 1300 199 589 with any inquiries uh, really delighted for you to join us today and to give us the opportunity to come into your home um, to do a presentation and talk about Steinway & Sons pianos. We'll advise you when we're doing it again. But once again, thank you very much to everybody. Thank you to my team for putting this together. It's not easy. Uh, they've worked very hard. We've got our marketing manager, Louis. We've got Davina here uh, working with us on all of our social media. We've got uh, Chris that's always behind the scenes and helping us. We've got our sales staff. We've got Jess in administration. We've got June as our sales staff. Uh, we've got our team in Sydney, Hudson and Anthea. Um, we've got our, our Dolly in Perth. We've got our whole team here ready to help you and uh, we really appreciate your support and hope to hear from you soon. Thank you very much.
extremely lucky to be supported from good friends of ours in Steinway Galleries Australia, um, some Australian icons. We've got John Foreman, we've got Harrison Craig, who's just come off a tour of Australia. We've also got, of course, James Morrison, probably one of the best, if not the best, trumpet player in the world. And we've also got Amir Farid, who's uh, been a long-time friend of Steinway Galleries Australia. Watching the piano respond to an iPad wirelessly and play back Wang Wang or Yu Jo Wang um, with unbelievable accuracy, as if they are sitting in your living room giving you a private recital. In the spirit of these great pianists that make the piano what it is, I'd like to invite another great pianist to uh, do this final number with me. Uh, his name is Simon Mulligan, and uh, as I said, he's from London, which is where he is right now. Take it away, Simon. If I was to tell someone about the Spirio, I think the main thing I'd tell them is, it's not a piano playing itself. It's a great artist playing your piano. We've had many of the pianos being pre-sold before the launch, and so this is the first opportunity where we've had stock, we've uh, caught up a little bit, and we've been able to release them to the public. We want him now to sort of keep that up. The more money we give to charity, the more money those charities can spend on medical research and keep all Australians a hell of a lot better off than being sick and not able to do anything about it. Hearing how the Spiro has integrated within Steinway, I just, it puts me at all. I don't think I can ever get sick of listening to it. I am oh, 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 I love to step right up to an upright or a fine tone. So, right, you can have the world's it's... best musician playing the piano in your own uh, home. It's very exciting. And the last thing I'd like to say as I walk away is, when someone asks me tomorrow, what did you do last night? I'm not going to say I played with the piano. I'm going to say I played with the Steinway. It's beautiful.